because now it's worse than this morning it's like three o'clock now and this morning when we we're here it was like 10 a.m so now it's even worse and i have to just sit here and pray to god so i'm i have some stuff I have some stuff that I need to do today, so um, it's 9 a.m. I'm going to go to the post office and what else? I have something to mail off for my friend. I'm going to go do that. And then I think there's a coffee shop next to it, so I'm going to probably sit there and kind of reconfigure my day and the rest of my week from there. Get some stuff done there, too. And I'm waiting on an Uber outside. I thought that was it just now. But um, yeah, I'm going on the road, going to the post office. I had said I was gonna go to the mall because I need to get, I need to re up on my scents. I need some new body sprays, but I don't think I'm gonna go today because that's like out of the way or whatever. But I don't know, I might just figure it out. I just have to like wait and see after i mail the stuff off where that's gonna go hair's holding up again it's been dumb long but it looks nice so i'm outside waiting for my is that is that the uber okay okay so i got yeah. what i needed done and i just decided to go back home i was gonna go to the duncan to <laughs> to buy some coffee roll and a coffee and i'm like seriously it's 9 a.m just go home <laughs> already it don't make no sense and they just costed me 24 25 dollars i'm like now nah, i'm not trying to spend no more after i just spent 25 dollars so i'm waiting on an uber to go back home and then i'm gonna make some coffee when i go home or i'm gonna just go to sleep because the only reason why i even got out of bed and did so much so early is because i wanted to come here early to send the stuff I had to send off so now I'm gonna go back and like clean up a little bit <clears throat> um, I started cleaning up but I left everything everywhere just so I can like run out and do what I have to do and then when I go back I can like finish that up so that's what I'm gonna do now and I feel like I'm gonna spend the rest of the day pretty much cleaning stuff up here and there I have some laundry that I want to do but I think I'm gonna just go by my friends and do it because I did that last weekend, or it was the weekend before. I can't really remember, but I think I'm gonna do that someday, at some point. But yeah, it's Tuesday, and I've ran all my errands and everything already, which is amazing. So guys, I'm going on the road with my friend today. Today is Wednesday, and um, oh, I'm serving hair. My hair is still holding up and everything. What was I gonna say just now? But gosh, to my skin. My skin has never done this good. And I feel like it's because lately I've really been cutting back on all the dairy and stuff like that, all the sweets. All I've been drinking is water, mainly because there's only water here. <laughs> there hasn't been any juice here for the longest, which is good because it allows me to like hold myself accountable, which is amazing too. So I've only been drinking water and my hair is doing amazing. Oh my gosh, I feel like such a proud hair person right now. And I'm not that big on hair. But this is good. Anyways, I'm going on the road today. It's like 9 a.m. It's going to be a super long day today. We're going to be on the road all day. I need a vanilla chai and a breakfast sandwich. Literally need one today. It's a good thing I didn't buy one yesterday. Because then I'd have to buy one today too. And that's extra spending. And I'm not really trying to do that right now. So it's good that I disciplined myself yesterday. Anyway, she's supposed to be pulling up any minute now. I need to get some water in my bottle so I can have that for the day. And then I will be ready to go. My head hurts so bad. So I'm going to ask her for two Exogen when I get there. Because those work wonders, literally. Let me text her now and to see if she like has them with her so she can bring for me if she does not have them anyways i just wanted to pop in and pop right back out welcome to the vlog this has literally been doing the most i mean it's clean and everything my eczema is not acting up or anything but there are these like discolorations in between and whatever i need to figure that out or 
find a way to like get rid of it i just need to be one tone that's it especially my face because everywhere else is fine everywhere else is like one tone and it's good but just my face is always doing everything with the different tones I'm so annoyed so we're in manhattan and it is first of all there's so much going on it's so ridiculous in itself but my friend has to be at this interview and she's in there but where we're parked you're not really supposed to be parking here so she like left her blinkers on just so it don't seem like she's parked here and i'm in the car now i'm hoping i'm praying to god nobody comes and says listen you have to move this car because for one I cannot drive I can but I can't not really and two even if I could drive I don't feel like Manhattan is the place where I can drive because there's just so much going on like it's so much to do people are trying to hit you from all angles and it's just so frustrating here in Manhattan I don't want to be driving in here either ways and I feel like that's why a lot of people in Manhattan don't drive I'd like to think I'm not even really sure if this is factual but gosh so now I'm literally on the edge of the seat because I'm really just hoping nobody comes and says I have to move the car because if that's the case I really cannot do that I, and I can't do that so my friend was like oh if somebody comes and says move the car please just text me it's gonna pop up on my watch because I don't want you fucking my car up which is literally probably what would happen if I was to move her car so I'm praying the universe is in my favor today and I really don't have to but I'm chilling right now just waiting and waiting when I say today is a crazy day it literally is a crazy day so this time <laughs> my friend decided to park in a tollway zone and she's like janine this is gonna be the end of the friendship if you let them tow away my car and i'm like nah now you know you done shut up when you go park in a tollway zone and tell me not to let them tow the car away i'm like you know you are dead wrong for this do not leave me here i'm not staying i'm not going out to argue with nobody like what am i gonna say don't tow the car away so she moved it to a spot where we might get a ticket and then she's like what are they gonna do give you a ticket they can't ticket you again and I'm like, okay, great. Either ways, we're... <laughs> and I have to just sit here and exist because I can't drive. This is, this is crazy. This is literally crazy because now it's worse than this morning. It's like 3 o'clock now. And this morning when we were here, it was like 10 a.m. So now it's even worse. And I have to just sit here and pray to God that whoever's going around giving tickets is in a great mood today and he's just like okay fine just make sure she moves it in like 15 minutes which is not gonna happen this is crazy